Herkese merhabalar. Bu akşam yine toplandık. Yine birbirinden güzel sorular. Yine 5, 6, 7 ve 8. sınıflara tek tek turnuva yapacağımız saatler. Ama önce 2 dakika bekliyorsunuz. Haber vermem gerekiyor. Sizler de son hazırlıklarınızı yapın. Çünkü yarışma birazdan başlıyor. Evet bakalım kimler varmış. Yapmamız gereken Google'dan Kahoot'a girmek ve sonrasında pin kodunu gösterdiğim pin kodunu yazmak. Bir team bir de nickname seçerek yarışmaya başlamak arkadaşlar. Hepsi bu kadar. Ve işte ilk turumuz 8. sınıflarla ve işte pin kodumuz gelsin. Tabi hepiniz katılabilirsiniz. İngilizcesine güvenen herkes katılabilir. Hello, all you have to do is to Google Kahoot and press the play Kahoot line and put the pin code that you are see, you can see on the screen and press enter and choose a team name, then a nickname and then press join. Don't forget to put your nickname to the team name because we are playing in the team mode for that reason you gotta be so very careful
Melih'cim yine değişik bir nick şeyleri bulmuşsun. Hazırsak 3 dakika içinde başlıyoruz. Dört tane turnuvamız olacak. Onar soruluk tıpkı dün gibi. Sekizlerden başlıyoruz. Yediler, altılar beş ve beşler diye. Beşinci sınıflar son olarak yarışacaklar. Mekanın sahibi onlar. Çünkü sekizleri bu sene yollayacağız. Gelecek sene... 7'leri yollayacağız. 6'lar ondan sonraki sene. Hazırsak Vira Bismillah deyip başlayalım o zaman. Yes. Now we've got 10 questions for the 8th grade. Aşık Veysel made music in blah blah blah music style. Pop, classical, folk, Indian. Which one? Yo, siz de cevaplayabilirsiniz. Melih'cim hayırdır yine ne oldu? What type of music did Aşık Veysel make? Okay, the correct answer was folk music. Classical music is like Chopin, 
Beethoven and the others. Pop music is like Tarkan, Indian music is like Indian pop bands. But uh, Ashok Vaisal made folk music and he was a great musician as you know Ashok Vaisal. Folk music means Hulk music. Pop, pop, classical, classical means classic. Indians means Indian Kızıl Derli ya da Hint müziği tarzı. Atay's team is number one. Onur is, Öznur is number two. Can is number three. Aysu is number four. And Hilal is number five. Here we go with the second question. If 16 of 20 students like pop music, then what is the percentage of this? 60%, 70%, 80%, 80% or 75%. You gotta divide into four, and for each part, you gotta put some percentage out of a hundred. If means air. Yes, 20 people knew the correct answer. It is like 80%. 20 öğrencinin 16'sı hoşlanıyorsa pop müzikten yüzde yüzde kaç oluyor? Yüzde 80 oluyor arkadaşlar. Here is the scoreboard. Atay is number one. Aysu is number two. Naz is number three. Enver is number four. And Bilgenur is number five. Here we go with the true-false question. I prefer listening to classical music than folk music. Bu cümle doğru mu yanlış mı arkadaşlar? Bir yanlışlıkları var sanki. Yoksa yok mu? Acaba var mı yok mu? Acaba yok mu var mı? Hemen doğru için maviye, kırmızı için yanlış için kırmızıya basıyorsunuz. Bu cümlede gramatik olarak bir doğruluk ya da yanlışlık var mı? Hemen karar veriyorsunuz. Bilmiyorsanız içgüdülerinize güvenin. Yes, it was false because instead of then, you gotta put two. I prefer listening to classical music to folk music. So for that reason, it was wrong. Let's see, Aisu is number one, Enver is number two, Ata is number three, Ömer is number four, and John is number five. By the way, Avdar is the highest climber. She climbed up 80 places. Congratulations, Avdarcığım. Here we go with the fourth question. Harry Potter can be an example for blah blah blah books. Sci-fi, romance, romance, realistic or fantasy? Fantasy, which one?
Yes, 36 people knew the correct answer. It was a fantasy book. It wasn't a sci-fi. Sci-fi means bilim kurgu. Romance means Lady of uh, What was the night? Şövalyenin aşkı ile ilgili sorular, hikayeler kısa ama romandan daha kısa. Realistik, gerçekçi, fantasy de uydurma hayal dünyasından bu tip Harry Potter'ın tarzındaki kitaplara deniyor. Fantezi kitapları. Dedikten sonra scoreboard'a baktığımızda <gülüyor> Yes, Enver is number one. Isu is number two. Dograshvili is number three. Can is number four. Hilal is number five. By the way, Hazreti Kolonya 53 Taksim A is the highest Climber, Hazreti, are you from Rize? Rize'den misin? 34 basamak birden yükselmiş ve tabii ki sıralamadaki en başarılı oyuncu olmuş. Dedikten sonra işte 5. sorumuz. Adam Levin is an impressive... Perfect, terrible or sensational voice. I love his songs. Maroon 5. Çocuklar. Yelda öğretmeninizin çalıştırdığı şarkı neydi? Memories. Memories'in söyleyicisi işte. Maroon 5'tan. Değil mi Erhan hocam? Aynen memories. Çocuklar burada nasıl yapabilirdik? Impressive etkileyici demek. Perfect mükemmel, terrible korkun, sensational aman tanrı. Sansasyonel gibi bir şey. Nasıl yapabiliriz? Burada a n ritmik olması gerekiyor ya. N geldiğine göre başlangıcının bir tane sesli harfle başlaması lazım. Şıklarda zaten anlamlarını hiçbirinin bilmeseniz bile şıklara baktığınızda Impressive'in tek uyan olduğunu görüp onu seçebilirdiniz. 14 arkadaşımız doğru cevap vermiş. 42 arkadaşım en perfect değil, a perfect olur arkadaşlar. Olsaydı. Ama doğru cevap Impressive. Yes, Enver is number one. Dograshvili is number two. Samet is number three. Mehmet is number four, Aysu is number five. By the way, Meryem Bacharan is the highest climber. She climbed up 40 places. Let's get to the next question. What is this? Oh my god, what is this? Is it a tent? Is it rope? Is it map? Or is it a pocket knife? Which one? Erhan Hocam, çocukların ben chat bölümüne fazla bakamıyorum. Sana zahmet sorularını falan yapıyorsun da. Flat yapanlara falan da küfür eden olursa, cevapları yazan olursa ne yapacağını biliyorum zaten. Bu arada bu muhteşem soruları hazırlayan Erhan Hocamıza canı gönülden kanal moderatörü olarak teşekkür ediyorum. Yes, the correct answer is 57 people that knew rope. It was a rope. So let's see the scoreboard. 
Enver is number one. Samet is number two. Dograshvili is number three. Mehmet is number four. And Aisu is number five. By the way, 21 p places that Adrian climbed up is the highest climber. She is the most successful player at the end of this question. Congratulations, Adrian Jim. Here we go with the seventh question. It's an open-ended question. You gotta type the answer. We use blah blah blah to find our find out the direction. Look at the picture. What is it? You gotta type in. Yön bulmaya yarayan alet. Neydi İngilizcesi? Hemen yazalım. Yo tutat demedim zaten. Kulaklarımdan hafifçe çektermiş. <gülüyor> I'm just kidding. Yusra, don't type here, okay, my friend. No answering here, okay. We don't answer in the chat room, okay? We gotta type in the on Kahoot and let's see. Dograshvili is number one, Enver is number two, Aisu is number three, Midget is number four, and Atai is back in the top five again. Congratulations, Atai Jim. Here we go, and we can see that, by the way. Aisu is back in the game with three in a row. Congratulations, Aisu Jum. Here we go with the next one. Question number eight. Even best friends sometimes argue blah blah blah each other. With two on at. Which one will come to the gap? Fill in the blank with one of those options. Is it with? Is it two? Is it on? Or is it at? Her akşam 8. sınıflarla başlıyoruz. 7'lere, 6'lara ve 5'lere doğru iniyoruz. Her bir sınıfın 10 sorusu var. Üniteler boyunca gidiyoruz. Sizler de her akşam bu saatlerde bildirimlerinizi açık tutmak şartıyla bildirimi alır almaz Yarışmada yerinizi alıyorsunuz. Yeni gelen arkadaşlar abone olup bildirimleri açmanız takti, e, e, açtığınız takdirde tabii ki sizler de bildirimleri aldığınızda yarışmaya hemen katılabiliyorsunuz. Okay, time is up. 33 people knew the correct answer. Argue with. Okay, argue with. Argue on something. Argue with somebody. Dograshvili is number one. Enver is number two. Midget is number three. Aisu is number four. Atay is number five. By the way, Midget has risen up to top three. Congratulations, Midget. And I don't know where you are from. Are you Yeet? Okay, question number nine. Put the words in order. I am fond of camping not. Put them in order. The correct one. Enver'cim söylesene ki soruları Enver Hoca, Erhan Hoca ayar hazırlıyordu.
<gülüyor> o şey komik ha. E şimdi Tonguç Akademi'ye hiçbiriniz gitmiyor. Tonguç Akademi'nin derslerini niye takip ediyorsun? Burada Erhan hocanızla beraber verdiğimiz bir emek var. O da saatlerini harcayıp soru hazırlıyor. Ben de hazırlıyorum. Dolayısıyla bizim ortak bir emeğimiz bu. Bakın bu hafta komple Erhan hocanızın sorularını sorduk. Geçen hafta da öyle. The correct order is I'm not fond of camping. 62 people knew the correct order. 62% of the total players. Dograshvili is number one. Mejit is number two. Enver is number three. Ata is number four. Meng is number five. By the way, it was a tough question. Five players just dropped their answer track of three. Dograshvili and Mejit, where are you guys from? The last question. Put the words in order. Yes, my favorite is Muratika YouTube channel. You gotta put them in order. It's not the correct order. You gotta put them in correct order. Düzgün sıraya koymanız gerekiyor arkadaşlar. Hangi renkten başlanılacaksa önce onu tıklıyorsunuz. Sonrasında ne gelecekse o. Sonrasında öbürü. Ondan sonra da öbürü. Şu anda düzgün gibi görünüyor ama değil. O kadarını diyeyim size. 2000 puanlık bir soru biliyorsunuz. Evet tekrar merhabalar. Yayın maalesef gidiyor bazen. Ne yapabilirim? Elimde olan bir şey değil çocuklar. Evet, üçüncü olan Enver, ikinci olan Mecit, birinci olan Dograşvili, bu arada bot atan arkadaşları ciddi anlamda anlamıyorum. Komik olduğunu zanneden arkadaşlar. Bir kere daha bakıyoruz. Number 3 is Enver. Number 2 is Midget. And number 1 is Dograshvili. Congratulations. And number 4 is Atay. And number 5 is Meng. Here we go with the next one. Now it's time for the seventh grade.
7. sınıflar için başladık. Here is the seventh grade ones. Now for the seventh graders. Yedinci sınıflar için başladık arkadaşlar. Direkçimi anlamadım. Ne demek istiyorsun? İnternet mi yok? Elli olunca başlıyoruz arkadaşlar. Okay, let's get started. Seventh grade unit two revision time. He couldn't carry on the game because of his what? Boot injury, spectators or trainer? Which one? Direkçim anlamadım ne demek istediğim. Erhan ne diyor Dilek anlamadım sen anladın mı? Çünkü ben ekrana bakıp yayın var mı yok mu kontrol etmekten yazışmaları maalesef okuyamıyorum. Dilek internet bir şeyler yazmışsın anlamadım kızım. Yes, he couldn't carry on the game because of his injury. Injury ne demekti arkadaşlar? Tabii ki yaralanma diyor. Oyuna devam edemedi yaralandığından dolayı. Yara almış, sakatlanmış yani. But spectators, spectators ne demekti gençler? Seyirciler, taraftarlar demekti. Trainer ve antrenör. Ya da trainers dediği de Amerikan İngilizcesinde spor ayakkabı anlamına da geliyor. Estrakısıyla. Sneakers, trainers ve benzeri. Dedikten sonra Team FNAF is number one. Uwu is number two. Hasan is number three. Hüseyin is number four. Elif Naz is number five. Here we go with the second question. You need walking sticks for what? Jogging, swimming, running, hiking. Which one?
Lütfen cevapları chat bölümünde yazmayın. Tekrar kelimeler etmeyin. Birbirinize karşı saygılı olun. Argo'dan ve benzeri başka kelimelerden uzak durun arkadaşlar. Bunları defalarca hatırlatıyoruz size. Gerek Erhan hocanız gerek ben. Ama ısrarla komik olduğunu zanneden arkadaşlar var bunları yaptıkça. Maalesef komik. Yes. Hasan is number one. Uğu is number two. Hüseyin is number three. Mehmet Kaan is number four. And Elif Naz is number five. Let's get to the third question. Open ended. 2000 points. Arrange the letters. What is this? Bu harflerden bir kelime oluşturmanız gerekiyor. Ve o kelimeyi hemen buraya yazmanız gerekiyor. Yediğiniz sınıf İngilizce yarışmaz. Yemek yemedim ya sinirden böyle. Yayın gidip geliyor ya onu çözmeye çalışıyorum arkadaşlar. O süre zarfında da böyle dişlerimi gıcırdatıyorum. But anyways, three people knew the correct answer. Answer. Opponent is the rakip. Karşı taraf anlamları var. Number one is Ming. Number two is hello. Number three is Hasan. Number four is Uwu. And number five is Hussein. By the way, Ming has a strike with three correct answers in a row. Congratulations that you started your fire and you're number one too. A bow is an equipment for archery, baseball, football or athletics. Bakınız bu soruların hepsini gündüzkülere ben hazırlıyorum. Akşamkilere Erhan hocanız ve her bir sınıf için ayrı ayrı 10 soru hazırlıyor. Ben olayım o olalım. Dolayısıyla lütfen emeğe saygı olarak birbirinize karşı ya da bizlere karşı ya da kanal içinde uyulması gereken hareketlerle ilgili kurallara uyalım arkadaşlar. Eminin gün emin olun günün sonunda hepimiz mutlu olacağız. Bizler öğrencilerine bir şeyler vermenin mutluluğuyla, siz de yeni bir şeyler ya da bildiğiniz şeyi tekrar etmenin huzuruyla mutlu olacaksınız. Yes, 29 people knew the correct answer. Above is an equipment for archery. And let's see the scoreboard. Number one is Ming. Number two is Hello. Number three is Mehmet. Number four is Uwu. And number five is Iqbal. Stick out thang. We miss you though. Hello has the highest answer strike of four and she started or he started his fire. Number five out of ten. Which is different? Baseball, hockey, rugby or tennis? Which one? NBA 2K20'nin internette bir sürü şeyi vardı Melih. Quizleri. Onu yazıp quiz diye yazıp yanına sorularını bulsana oğlum. Evet. 
Hep aynı soru çeşitlerini yapıyoruz. Bak NBA 2K20 hiç yapmadık mesela. Ona yarın da bir bak. Olmazsa sen Roblox'a biraz ara verelim. Çünkü çok Roblox ve Bravo Stars yaptık. Yarın akşamın soruları hazır zaten. Yarın akşam Erhan Hoca'nızın Ultimate Game Player Pro e, düzeyinde bir yarışmamız var. Yarın akşam. Aklınızda bulunsun. Bu arada beyzbol, hockey ve rugby takım oyunu tenis bireysel oyun olduğu için farklı olan o. Altı arkadaşımız bulmuş bunu. Meng is number one, hello is number two, Mehmet is number three, stick out tang is number four, and Iqbal, aka Iqbal, also known as, and Uvo is number five. By the way, Atay's team is the highest climber. He climbed up 14 places. Congratulations! Here we go with the true-false question. You get a bronze medal if you are second in a race. True or false? Bronze medal. Second. True or false? Durmadan flat yapıyorsun o yüzden dolayı engellemiştir. Aynı şeyi devamlı yazınca biliyorsun kanal kurallarında bunlar var. Melihçim. Bir kere yazınca görüyor bak o benim gibi ekrana bakmıyor sadece chat room'da görünüyor. Beni hani yakalamak için bir şey söyleyeceğin zaman ben hem ekrana bakıyorum hem chat room'a bakıyordum o zamanlar tamam ama şu anda Erhan hocam sadece chat room'la ilgileniyor. Dolayısıyla sen bir kere bir şey yazdığında o zaten onu görüyordur. 500 kere tekrar etmenize gerek yok diye yazılıyor yani flat yapmayın diye. Melihçim anladın mı oğlum? Yes, absolutely. 32 people knew the correct answer. Because if you get a bronze medal, that means you're number three in a race, not number two. If you are second in a race, you get a silver medal. Okay? So, here is the scoreboard. Number one is Meng. Number two is Hello. Number three is Mehmet. Number four is Iqbal Stick Out Tang. And number five is Esma. Esma, hi to... You from the top five. By the way, Mehmet has the highest answer track of three, and he started his fire. Congratulations! Here we go with the seventh question. Which one is different? Climbing, volleyball, yoga, surfing. Which one? Onun elinde olan bir şey değil. 300 saniye sonra açılacak zaten evladım. Bir de böyle yaptırımlar yapıyorsun. Şimdi bak adam sinirlenecek. Böyle yapılıyor işte bak canlı yayın yapıyoruz. Belli bir... Sanırım canlı yayında belli bir... Takipçi kotası var arkadaşlar. Yes, 21 people knew the correct answer. Volleyball is an is different from the others. Climbing and surfing and also yoga are outdoor activities and the other one is Meng is number one Mehmet Khan is number two stick out tongue is number four three hello is number four and Esma is number five by the way Elif is the highest climber she climbed up 15 places congratulations Elif and let's get to the eighth question 
2000 points which one is different boxing hiking bowling skiing which one Yes, 21 people knew the correct answer. It was boxing. And boxing is also, it is like one-on-one -on -one kind of uh, sports activity. And the other difference between them is do boxing and go hiking, go bowling, go skiing, you can say. Okay, yeah, and do all the boxing. Hiking, bowling ve skiing go ile yapılıyor dedikten sonra bir de biri de one on one, on one şeklinde bir hmm, spor çeşidi dedikten sonra o anlamda da farklılığını görebiliyorsunuz. İkbal is number one, Meng is number two, Hello is number three, Mehmet is number four, Ömer Moruçuk is number five and five players just hit answer track of three and let's get to the Ninth question. Jack played in the match yesterday, but he didn't score any goals because his leg was broken, he had an injury, he was the goalkeeper, he had something else to do at home. Which one? Yes, 36 people knew the correct answer because he was the goalkeeper. If you were a goalkeeper, you can't score any goals. That's very normal. Yes, number one is stick out. Number two is Meng. Number three is Mehmet. Number four is Hello. And number five is Hussein. Four players have reached answer strike of four. They started their fire. Here we go with the last question for the 7th graders. Let's go. Put them in order. Is my favorite Muratika YouTube channel. Which one?
Okay, let's see. 56% of total players knew the correct order. Let's see the top five on podium. Yes, number one is Iqbal, number two is Meng, number four, uh, three is Mehmet. Let's see one more time. Mehmet is eight out of ten. Meng is eight out of ten. And Iqbal is nine out of ten. And number four is Hello, and number five is Fidel from 7E. Let's get to the next one. Sixth graders, are you guys ready? Okay, let's go. Let's get our music. Bütün altıncı sınıfları bekliyorum. Daha doğrusu bekliyoruz. Haydi bakalım. Meri, ay Meri, sana zahmet. NBA 2K20 bulmaya çalış oğlum. Enes'cim yapman gereken Kahoot'a girmek. Onun adresi de kahoot.it Bak ekranda görünüyor şu anda. Şu adres yukarıdaki adrese başka bir ekrandan giriyorsun. Ya da cep telefonunda Kahoot uygulaması yüklüyse Game Pin Enter Game Pin bölümüne 829451'i yazıyorsun ya da kaut.it adresinde sonrasında Enter'a basıyorsun Enter'dan sonra Team Name bölümü çıkıyor oraya Enes Varel diye kaçıncı sınıftan yazıyorsun sonrasında Next'e bastıktan sonra Nickname bölümü çıkıyor oradaki kutucuklardan bir tanesi yani bir nokta koyup Join tuşuna bastığın anda yarışmaya katılabiliyorsun. Bütün bunları yapmak yaklaşık 8 ila 9 saniye sürüyor. Bekliyoruz. Sezer büyük ihtimal senin aa, sen söyleyi ver şeyin takipçi sayın mı acaba şey yapmıyor? Wow, we've got Donald Trump as well. He's watching us. Aynen böyle Enes. Okay, let's get started. Here we go.
Which one is unhealthy? Look at the pictures, all the things, and after them, look at the... Mm, yeah, okay, I can see them. The options, which one is unhealthy? Muffin, olive, cheese, or butter? Which one? Hit the correct button, which is unhealthy. Hi, Martin. Bugün internet sezercim çok yavaş. Sa öğlenleyin de benim mesela şeyim bağlantıda kaç kere koptu tekrar yapmaya çalıştım. Arkadaşlarım da bilir hatta. Bugün internette bir problem vardı. Okay, now time is up. 41 people knew the correct answer. Muffin. Even if it is yummy, it is unhealthy though. Olive means, you know, zeytin. Cheese means peynir. Butter means... Tereya, muffin. You know that tek kekler oluyor ya, kabartılı kağıtlarda böyle. Allah Allah, yanına da bir cappuccino ya da kahve. Değil mi Erhan hocam ama şekersiz olmalı. Kahvemiz. Değil mi Erhan hocam? Dedikten sonra Joy is Joy is stop stop it. <gülüyor> stop ID is number one. I cut your tongue is number two. Iron Man Iron Dur number three. Fidel is number four and Ata is number five. Yes, let's get to the second question. Tereya sağlıklı zaten. Okay, what is this? Look at the picture. Is it pancake? Is it sausage? Is it olive or is it butter? Which one? You are a tea guy. Are you a tea guy? Ben de, I'm not a cake man, not a muffin man either. I'm into Turkish coffee though. It's the yummiest thing ever. Ömer'cim bunlar sizin konular. Seni ilk 5'te hatta ilk 3'te görmek istiyorum. Haberin olsun. Olive is the, name, is the answer of this question. Number 1 is Atay. Number 2 is I cut your tongue. Number 3 is Iron Man. Number 4 is Utkucan. And number 5 is Elif. By the way, Acidic X is the highest climber. He climbed up 18 places. Congratulations! Here we go with an open-ended question. 2,000 points. Rearrange the letter and write a food. What is this? Çaydan mı bahsediyorsun Erhan? Çay içmeyeceğim başını ağrıyor dost. Ben Türk kahvesinden başka hiçbir şey içmiyorum ya. Onu da şekersiz içiyorum. 
Yes, the correct answer is bagel. In Turkish, we can say susamsız simit or açma, but açma is more uh, or, uh, greasy, you know. In English, I ate some bagels when I was in the U.S. It was a Hebrew kind of food. I tongue, I cut your tongue is number one. Utkujan is number two. Ata is number three. Ali is number four. Fidel is number five. By the way, Glowing Rhino 54 just hit answer track of three. Congratulations. And here we go with the fourth question. Chips, hamburger, muffin are blah, blah, blah, food. Healthy, junk, nutritious, or sweet. Which one? Ah, I see. Ben şekersiz içiyorum. Şekerli içemiyorum. Selam Elif'cim, hoş geldin. Kaç gündür yoksun kızım? Biraz daha bunlar bitince 5. sınıflarınki başlayacak. 10'ar soruluk 4 grup yapıyoruz. Birinci grupta 8'lere sorduk. ikiniz grupta 7'lere sorduk. Üçüncü grupta şimdi 6'lara soruyoruz. Birazdan da 5'lere soracağız. 43 arkadaşımız doğru cevap verdi. Chips, hamburger, muffin are junk food and... I don't want you to be any of you guys to be a junk food junkie. It's not a good thing to eat junk food constantly. Okay, number one is I cut your tongue. Why are you so very savage? Yeah, it is because it's not nice to write that as a nickname. Utkujan is number two, Ata is number three, Ali is number four, and Fidel is number five. By the way, six players have reached answer track of three. And here we go with the fifth question. 2,000 points again. What is this? Look at the picture. Is it omelette? Is it chips? Is it coffee? Or is it cereal? Which one? What is this? Omelette, chips, coffee or cereal? Which one? İlk yazınca en yüksek puanı alabiliyorlar. Aran hocam. Yes, 50 people knew the correct answer. It was cereal. I'm not into cereals. Do you? I don't like to eat. Yes, number one is Aykat, number two is Utkucan, number three is Atay, number four is Fidel, and number five is Joy. And let's see that Mirai is the highest climber. She climbed up 12 places. Congratulations! Here we go with the sixth question. What is this? Croissant, bagel, burger, or sandwich? Which one? Geç kalma.
Kadir saçmalıyorsun. Okay, 49 people knew the correct answer. Croissant is the correct answer. Aykat is number one. Utkucan is number two. Atay is number three. Fidel is number four. And finally, welcome Ömer number five. By the way, Glowing Rhino 54 has the highest answer track of six. Congratulations that you started your fire. Yay! Let's get to the seventh question. True or false? My sister dislikes pancakes. True or false? Oh my goodness. There are one, two, three, four pancakes in a row. Mehmet 5. sınıflarda birinci olursun sen çıkıyorsun ama Mouse'unu temizleyeceksin işte bu yarışmalara başlamadan önce yapılacaklar listeniz olsun arkadaşlar Birincisi cepten giriyorsan telefonun şarjı full olacak İkincisi eğer cepten giriyorsan telefonun ekranı temiz olacak temizlenmiş olacak Üçüncüsü, eğer bilgisayardan giriyorsan bilgisayarda birden fazla pencereyi açık olmayacak. Dördüncüsü, bilgisayardan giriyorsan bilgisayarın temiz olacak, mouse'unu da temizleyeceksin. Çünkü zamana karşı yarışılıyor burada. En hızlı şekilde en yüksek e, doğru cevabı veren ilk kişi en yüksek puanı alıyor biliyorsunuz. Yes, it was a false sentence. And 28 people knew the correct answer because even if it says she dislikes, it must be she dislikes pancakes. Okay. Number one is I cut your tongue. Number two is Utkucan. Number three is Fidel. Number four is Omer. And number five is Dynamiters. And Gamze is the highest climber. She climbed up 11 places. Congratulations. Here we go with the 8th question. Puzzle. Put the words in order. Your favorite food. What is? Put them in order. Correctly. Okay, you can subscribe the filthy weep, the filthy, the filthy weep. You can subscribe first. Turn on the uh, notifications. Turn the alert on, and go to kahoot.it and enter the pin code eight two nine four five one. Sorry, sir, if I miss the messages because I'm. Announcing the question, the pin code is written on the left hand side down the screen 829451. Yes, what is your favorite food is the correct order of these words. Yes, question number nine write the English ter term for Rachel. What is this in English? Look at this picture and tell me here what is this. It's a three-letter word. It's not marmalade. It is not. Another one. You gotta write it down in that box. Players, type your answer here. Part. The English version of Richard 
What is Rachel in English? So you guys from the other countries, you learned that Rachel means blah blah blah in English. So it's kind of a win-win. Okay, Rachel in English is gem. So Turkish Rachel, English gem. So you know now a new word in Turkish, Rachel. Just like CH sound here with a tail below Rachel. Okay, in English we say gem, in Turkish we say Rachel. Okay, number one is I cut number two is Utkucan, number three is Omer, number four is Fidel, number five is Stick Out. By the way, she's got a streak with nine correct answers in a row. Congratulations that she started her fire. The last question 2000 points. Order the words just like the others. Put them in order, in the correct order to get the 2,000 point question correctly. Bu Kadir kendini komik mi zannediyor? Kadir evladım niye böyle yapıyorsun? Yazık günah değil mi hem sana hem de buradaki herkese? Allah Allah! No garbage, I can't. You know why? Because we are playing through internet and we don't have enough time. And plus, because of the lockdown at home using internet all around the world, internet gets slower. So for that reason, we gotta arrange it to set it to 60 seconds. I'm sorry, but I tried and nobody could answer. Yield, yield. Yes, my favorite YouTube channel is Muratika is the correct order and let's get to the podium. We are starting in a few minutes. The other Kahoot, don't leave now. Stay tuned for the next one. It will be the last Kahoot. Number one is Aikat, number two is Fidel, number three is Omer. Omer, finally, I congratulate you. Let's see number four and five again. Then we will get to the next Kahoot. Yes, Omer is 10 out of 10. Fidel is 10 out of 10. And Aikat is 10 out of 10 too. Number four is stick out tongue and number five is dog rush really. Here we go with the next one. Are you guys ready? The fifth graders. Here we go. With the last one, of course. Let's get our quest music. Signal music. I don't really understand why are you using cussing words. There are minors here. And it shows that how good you are, how polite you are. It's not nice to use that kind of lingo.
The pin code is 295127. If you're watching us and want to play Kahoot, go to www.kahoot.it or if you got Kahoot application installed on your Please don't use any words like that because there are some minors here. It's not allowed. I'm sorry. Okay. I win. It's yes. It's not nice what you are doing to put a boot or something to put a, an Autobot. It's not nice what you're doing. Please remove them. I'm telling you. I win. I told you. Don't use bots because there are little kids here. You gotta have respect to them, okay? You gotta respect for everybody else. I'm a teacher and the thing that you are doing is not nice. Okay, here we go with the fifth question, the fifth grade questions. Yes, which is different? November, December, January or February? Hi Henry Yes, the correct answer is November As you know, November is the month of autumn And the rest of them are the month, months of the season, winter season So the difference is November Let's get to the other one. Number one is Daddy Sean. Number two is Hussein. Number three is Mehmet. Number four is Naz. Number five is Bilgenur. And let's get to the second question. Open ended, 2000 points. Rearrange the letters and write a day. It's a day. What day is it? İkbalcığım aynı şeyleri yazma kızım. Ne yaptı sana? O senin için değil ki. O sana yazılmış bir şey değil kızım. Her şeyi üstüne alma. İkbalcığım sana yazmıyor. Sakin olur musun lütfen? Bak şu anda yarışmayı bıraktık. Sen de şey yapıyoruz. Sakinleştirmeye çalışıyoruz. Lütfen böyle şeyler yapmayın şunu ya. İnsanlara karşı saygılı olur musunuz hepiniz? Please be respectful to each other. P 
He's not, he's not, he's not doing it. Stay calm, calm down, easy. Yes, Thursday is the correct answer. 25 people knew the correct answer. Çocuklar birbirinize karşı tehditvari bir şeyler yazmayın lütfen. Yes, YHO is number one. Bigenur is number two, Ömer is number three, Naz is number four, and Stick Out Tang is number five. By the way, Fidel is the highest climber. He climbed up 69 places. Congratulations. Question number three, 2,000 points. When is the victory day of Turkey? In April, in August, in May, or in October? Which one? The victory day. Ali niye şey yapıyorsun? Ya birinize flat yapmayın diyorum öbürü başlıyor. Niye küçük çocuk gibisiniz ya? Ben onu anlamıyorum. Bakın Erhan hocanızı üzdünüz. Yeah, I know. 13 seconds. It is delayed. That's because of too much internet is used all around the world. People are locked down and the schools shut down. So for that reason, internet is not enough for any of us. As you know, Netflix got into the standard definition and what's up? doesn't let you use more than once to re-send the message but the answer is in august and today we had all the day long all day long we had a problem with internet and it's getting worse day by day people are locked down at home you know because of the coronavirus it didn't used to be like this but i can't do anything for that even if I keep the Viteza as fast as they can. Yes, number one is Iqbal, number two is Naz, number three is Bilgenur, number four is YHO, and number five is Ekin. By the way, Iqbal has a strike with three correct answers in a row. And now question number four. What is the synonym of autumn? You guys know this. The synonym of autumn. What do we say in American English? Arkadaşlar şu anda iki tane öğretmen var ve sizler gayet rahat bir şekilde şey yapıyorsunuz. Hiç hoş değil. Bak ailelerinize temsil ediyorsunuz burada. Bak öğretmeninizi niye yoruyorsunuz? Ben buradan gözlemleyerek, o oradan engelleyerek ama yazık günah değil mi bize de ya? Emek vermişiz, sorular hazırlamışız zaten o kadar. Ondan bir yorulmuşuz bir de yarışmayı yaparken yoruluyoruz. Anlamak mı istemiyorsunuz? Garbage YouTuber, don't write. Yes, the correct answer is fall. Don't write here, garbage, in the chat room. No, no writing. You're not allowed to write any answers in the chat room. Naz is number one, Iqbal is number two, YHO is number three, which is midi. Bigenur is number four and Ekin is number five. By the way, Avdar is the highest climber. She climbed up 38 places. Congratulations. By the way, for the newcomers, don't forget to subscribe and turn the alert on to get notified for the next Kahoot tournaments. Which one is different? January, May, June, October. Which one? Öyle yapacağız zaten Seyit Ahmet. 
Erhan bir dahakini de chat'i açmayalım. Ne diyorsun? Sana uyarsa okey de. Okay, the correct answer is June. That's because January, May, and October consist of 31 days, but June has got 30 days. So the difference between all of them against June is this. So here is the scoreboard. Equal is number one. Ekin is number two. Fifth personality is number three. Naz is number four, and YHO is number five. By the way, it was a tough round and the combo breaker. Three players just dropped their answer track of four. I'm sorry to see this. By the way, for the weekend, we are going to have a Harry Potter tournament. Do you guys want it? Are you ready for the Harry Potter special weekend? If you guys are ready, We are going to play Harry Potter as well. Okay? Say yes in the chat room. If you want to play with us Kahoot on Harry Potter. Yes, question number six. Which is spelled correctly? February, August, April, October. Which one? Which one is written correctly, spelled correctly? Choose the correct option and hit the button as fast as you can. Okay, August was the correct spelled word. Ekin is number one. Fifth personality is number two. Stick out is number four, three. Naz is number four, and YHO is number five. By the way, Seyit Ahmed is the highest climber. He climbed up 12 places. Congratulations, Seyit Ahmed Jim. Here we go with the next one. Question number seven. The day after Friday is Saturday. Is it true or false? The day after Friday is Saturday. True or false? Hafta sonunda Harry Potter special weekend yapıyoruz. Harry Potter'ı sevenler hazır olsunlar, duyurulur. Erhan hocamız çok çılgın Harry Potter sorularıyla karşınıza gelecek. Hay galaba.
Okay, 35 people knew the correct answer. The day after Friday is Saturday, which is correct. And let's see the scoreboard. Ekin is number one. Fifth personality is number two. Stick out tongue is number three. YHO is number four. And Nas is number five. By the way, Ekin has the highest answer track of seven. Congratulations, Ekin Jim. Here we go with the eighth question. 2,000 points, summer season starts with what month? June, May, July, April. Which one? Oh my goodness. Let the summer start. Mavi yeter şu anda öyle bir şey yok mod, mod beni yapsın sen Erhan sana Mod falan mı vereceğiz dedi ne dedi ben görmedim öyle bir mesaj da yazmamış Mavi turna yarın saat 3'e doğru en erken sen gelirsen yarınki gündüz kuşağında moderatörü sizlerden seçiyoruz biliyorsun. İlk mesaj atan öğlen kuşağında saat 3'teki kuşakta ilk mesaj atana mod veriyoruz biliyorsunuz. O yarışmada moderatör oluyor. Yes 28 people knew the correct answer. The summer starts with June. Here we go to the scoreboard. Number one is Ekin, number two is fifth personality. YHO is number three. Naz is number four and beginner Potter. Beginner, we are waiting for you on the weekend to play Harry Potter special with you as well. And number five is beginner. By the way, he started his fire because he's back with an answer track of three. Congratulations. Question number nine. How many days are there in 12 weeks? 84, 74, 79, 82. Which one? Aynen Elif bugün sen oldun. Dün ırmak olmuştu, evvelsi günde yiğit olmuştu. Bakalım yarın kim olacak? How many days are there in 12 weeks? 74, 84, 74, 79 or 82? Which one? Okay, the correct answer is 84, which is the red button, and 27 people knew the correct answer, but 9 people weren't able to answer correctly. Yes, let's see. Number 1 is the 5th personality, number 2 is Ekin, number 3 is YHO, and number 4 is Nas, and number 5 is Beginner. By the way, Ekin has the highest answer track of 9. Congratulations, you started your fire and it is shown on the top 3. The last question, 2000 points, order the words. The same thing, put them in order. Canlı yayına ben ilk giriyorum mesela bir bakıyorum Yiğit olsun Yiğit Kurtbaş Arda Kurtbaş Irmak Elif anında geliyorlar nasıl geliyorsunuz bir söylesenize 
Orada bildirim mi gelmiş oluyor çocuklar? Okay, 52% of the total players number have known the correct answer. Let's get to the podium to end this to end tonight. End up tonight. Number three is YHO. Number two is Ekin. And number one is the fifth personality number four is beginner number five is ikbal yay i just want to congratulate all of you guys at heart and thank you for joining us today tonight actually take very good care of yourself wash your hands with lots of water and soap stay calm stay <clears throat> safe stay home stay with me and that's because of the coronavirus. We all stay home. Schools are shut down. We are locked down. And we are playing Kahoot all day long. See you tomorrow and bye for now. Tomorrow at 3 p.m. Turkish time. Check the website, check the info below the video to check out what time yours will be. And bye for now. Kendinize çok iyi bakıyorsunuz. Ellerinizi bol su ve sabunla yıkıyorsunuz. Yarın öğlen görüşmek üzere. Şimdilik hoşça kalın. İyi geceler. Görüşmek üzere.